welcome back today we are going to solve this question so this question we take from cambridge interview problem can you solve this problem if you can then pause the video and take a try otherwise let's see the solution so this is our question the whole under root 10 plus under root 24 plus under root 40 plus under root 60 so we have to simplify this to the shortest form so for finding this solution we notice that this part of the question under root 24 under root 40 and under root 60 so here this one under root 40 can be written as this one 24 24 can be break down this one can be written as 2 into 2 into 2 into 3 so here is 2 2 is come out so here is it can be written as 2 into under root 6 and 40 can be written as now we break 40 by factorize this so here is it can be written as 2 into 2 into 2 into 2 into 5 so now it can be written as 2 under root 10 2 under root 10 now here under root 60 so now we break 60 by factorial method so here is 2 into 2 into 3 into 5 so here it can be written as this one is 2 into and this one is 15 so it is 2 into 115 so now we put the value of this one in this under root so it is 10 plus this can be written as 24 is equal to 2 under root 6 2 under root 6 and here is plus 40 under root 40 is written as 2 under root 10 now plus under root 60 so it can be written as 2 under root 15 here so now we notice in this equation here is the 2 2 and 2 and 2 is in all one so we take the common 2 so here is very common so it is under root 6 plus under root 10 plus under root 15 this one so now here we notice in this this one under root 6 under root 10 under root 15 this one so now we break this under root 6 can be written as under root 2 into under root 3 and this under root 10 can be written as under root 2 into under root 5 and under root 15 can be written as under root 3 into under root 5 so now we put this values in this places here is 10 plus 2 into here is under root 2 into under root 3 and here under root 10 is equal to under root 2 into under root 5 and plus and here is under root 15 is equal to under root 3 into under root 5 this one now we notice in this uh, identities we use this identity a plus b plus c is equal to a square plus b square plus c square plus 2 into a b plus b c plus c a so here this one is equal a b plus b c plus c a so here is a is equal to under root 2 b is equal to under root 3 and here is c is equal to under root 5 so now we notice on 10 so 10 can be written as a square plus b square plus c square so here is a is equal to under root 2 so now we square it under root 2 square plus under root 3 square plus under root 5 square this one so now we put this all values on in this identities on this identities so it can be written as here under root under root here is 10 is equal to this one under root under root 2 the whole square plus under root 3 the whole square plus under root 5 the whole square and now here is same is 2 into under root 2 into under root 3 plus under root 2 into under root 5 plus under root 3 into under root 5 so now this can be represented on the this identities so here this one is a square and this one is b square and this one is c square and here is 2 here is a b and this one is b c and this one is c a so now we put this on this identities a plus b plus c the whole square so here is under root 2 plus under root 3 plus under root 5 the whole square this one so here this under root and the power is cancelled out because under root is written as the power 1 by 2 this one is cancelled so here the answer is under root 2 plus under root 3 plus under root 5 
this one so this one is our final answer so here these can be written in the shortest form as under root 2 plus under root 3 plus under root 5 thank you so much for watching my video if you like the video then subscribe our channel and share it to your friends thank you so much